Today I will show you how to make the search bar animation. Go to titles, search for the default title and add it on the timeline. Let's extend it so we can see it better. Click on it, go to advanced, select the text and click the trash icon to remove it. Then go to add shape, add the middle one, delete the text because we don't need it. And also let's make the edges of the shape straight, so click on it, grab the yellow square and extend it. Scroll down to shape fill and lower the opacity to zero. Go down to shape border, make sure the color is white and increase the size to four. Click outside so the shape is created. Let's extend it, make it smaller and make sure to place it in the middle. Now it's time to add the icons. To do that, go to add image. Both of the images will be linked below, so let's add the mic first. And with it being selected, press OK. Because you can adjust it better here, go to transform. Let's lower the scale. 6 should be enough. And place it on the left side. So this looks nice. Click on the title again, go to advanced. Let's add the other image, the search icon. Press OK. Just like the mic lower the scale to 6 and we will place this on the right side. This is how it will look. Go back to advanced and it's time to add a title. Go to add text. Let's lower the size to about 24 and scroll down to remove the text border and shadow. This way it will look better. Go back up to type the text you want, for example, how to make a search bar. To adjust it easier, use the keyboard arrows, so click the left one. This should be enough. And it's time to add the animation. Select the text, go to animation. We will use the typewriter effect. This way it seems like you are typing. So now let's adjust it. I don't want the animation at the end to happen. So what I will do is grab it and extend it to the end. This way there is no animation. Let's adjust the start. For example, you can choose how long you want the typing to happen. So if you want it shorter, extend it to the left. This way the typing happens faster. And if you want it for a longer duration, extend it to the right. So now it will go really slow. I will choose a decent speed, so around here. Let's see how that looks. And I like it. What you can do next is go to save as custom. Let's name it search bar animation and press OK. Press OK again. So now anytime you go to Titles and Custom, you will find it there. Let's add it on the second layer and you can see how it looks. Click on it and change it to whatever you want. For example, I will type how to edit a video. Select it and adjust the placement. To make it stand out more, click on the video, go to Color, down to Tone and lower the brightness. This way it stands out more. Another thing you can do is add typing sound effects. Let's add this one under it. Cut where the typing starts, remove the other part and place it where the animation happens. So when it ends, click on it and cut it again, remove the other part. This is the final result. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did leave a like and subscribe and I will see you on another one. Bye.